Welcome to Module 7, Professional Responsibility, Exam Prep. Laws that pertain to the professional conduct of a peer support specialist include the Baker Act, the Marchman Act, 42 CFR, and the Florida Statutes that Mandate Abuse Reporting, Chapter 39 for Children, and Chapter 415 for Adults. Peer support specialists are required to report suspected abuse to the abuse hotline, whether their client is the alleged victim or the alleged perpetrator. Confidential client information can only be released upon written consent of the client. Exceptions to this principle are when there is a duty to warn, a suspicion of abuse that must be reported, or if a valid court order requires the release. Because peer support specialists use their lived experience as examples for their clients, they have a professional and ethical responsibility to manage their own wellness and recovery. Peer support specialists should seek appropriate support and supervision if they're experiencing a decline in wellness in any dimension. Cultural competence is a fundamental ingredient that helps develop trust as well as an understanding of the way members of different cultural groups define health, wellness, addiction, and recovery. Finally, the peer support specialist must make sure that the content of the clinical record is clear, concise, precise, and accurate. The clinical record speaks for the client in recording progress through the treatment and recovery process.